Cabinet Secretary Janet Napolitano testified before our Senate Judiciary Committee this week. I questioned her about the work of her Department of Homeland Security, which was designed to defend the nation's borders and our infrastructure. In the last three months, two of the department's own agents have been murdered in the line of duty. Agencies of our own government have contributed to this violence by intentionally allowing thousands of guns to be trafficked from the United States into Mexico. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms and Explosives decided to let thousands of guns walk after being purchased by straw buyers intent on reselling them. Many of those guns ended up in the hands of bandits who operate on the border trafficking drugs and other illicit goods back into the United States. This risky strategy did not occur in a vacuum. There are serious questions to be answered about the role played by the Justice Department and certain agencies within the Department of Homeland Security. The policy has affected the lives of countless individuals who may have been victims of crimes perpetrated as a result of putting guns into the hands of criminals. Agents on the ground were ignored when they questioned the wisdom of this decision from higher up. When the agents came forward with concerns, you know what? They were shunned and re even retaliated against. The American people deserve answers. There's no legitimate excuse for the people not getting answers. I also asked the secretary at the Judiciary Committee meeting about memos prepared by officials in her department on how the administration can circumvent Congress to provide legal status to millions of people who are in the country illegally. I continue to ask about the Department of Homeland Security using the Privacy Act as an excuse to stonewall Congress and in the end end up protecting the rights of terrorists. And I'm pressing for answers on repeated delays in requiring compliance with the real ID law. Our government is organized so that Congress can require accountability and provide oversight of the activities of the United States government. And congressional oversight is a top priority for me in the United States Senate. The people of this country have a right to know. And the right to know brings transparency to government and with transparency, you get more accountability.